Now we want to go from solutions in the phase plane to solutions y of t and x of t for a first order linear system. So I've put in a first order linear system dx dt is x plus 4y and dy dt is minus 2x minus 5y. Window in the phase plane minus 3 to 3 and minus 3 to 3 and the typical terrible time interval 0 to 25. Well, we'll just adjust that. Let's take a solution with initial conditions of 0 and minus 2. Here I'm decaying to the origin, but I'm going to be swept into a dominant solution. I'm not interested in displaying the straight line solutions here, but I am interested in looking at this hook and how it alters the x and t and y of t graphs. I'm going to choose a more reasonable time scale. How about minus 3 to 5? Redraw the solution. Yes, look at this hook. Let's look at it from the y of t perspective. y is very negative. And then as time goes forward, that's the green. y rises through 0, rises up, maybe not quite as high as 1, and then it starts to fall back to the origin. So my initial y value is negative 2, and I go through negative 2, rising up through 0, a bump, a maximum that's maybe not quite 1, and then decay slowly back to the origin through positive values. The past of this solution, y, is largely negative. The x of t solution, well, the original x value is 0, and the original x value is being zero, the past was positive x values, and the future is negative x values. So I start at zero, zero, and before that to the left, I had positive x values. I'm going down through zero, zero, and then as x goes down, it goes out here almost to two, negative two, and then recovers back to the origin. So negative, more negative, more negative, turn the corner, less negative, less negative, less negative to zero. And that's shown in this shape where I come down through zero, zero, I go to a minimum value, and then I recover slowly to zero. This kind of shape here, we could call it not an exponential decay, but kind of a hooked exponential decay. It's a very characteristic shape of solutions, systems that have straight line solutions experiment with this system others like it other systems with straight line solutions and see if you can predict the qualities of these hooked exponentials do the bumps to the higher low points occur after or before the initial condition how do i cross the threshold here at t equals zero and do i decay back to zero from below or from above it's all things you should be able to recognize from the original drawing.